Welcome to JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Jamie Scott Okataya here in fabulous Honolulu. Take a look at this video shot from a drone, care of Excite Modular. This is PTC 2019. Joining me today, my friend, Mr. Michael LaHood. He's the COO and partner of Stream Data Centers. Michael, welcome to JSA TV. Thank you very much. Glad to be here. And actually, we had the honor of interviewing you here last year at this time, and we were talking about all of your DFW7 news. Right. So Dallas area, obviously your backyard. Tell us, what do you have in store? So we, uh, we broke ground late last year uh, on a brand new facility, Garland, Texas, uh, 138,000 square feet on-site substation, so we'll have a great power story, uh, very low energy pricing for the market. Uh, that building will deliver uh, 3 megawatts of power day one, scalable up to 37 uh, and a half megawatts, um, and delivers uh, kind of into the summer of this year. Oh, wonderful. And um, again, you great success for you guys in those core markets, like your home base, Dallas. But you're also able to really pursue opportunities in sub-markets as well. Tell us a little bit more there. When you, you said sub-markets? Yeah. Sorry, uh, windy, windy out here today. Um, the, uh, so, so uh, you know, uh, Dallas is home, but we've, we've had a successful track record all over the, the United States. Um, new, uh, new developments, we announced, I think we actually announced Chicago here last year as well. So we delivered that uh, a few weeks ago uh, in the heart of Elk Grove Village. Uh, we've also been successful in, um, in Minneapolis here recently with two, uh, two projects, two new um, operational facilities. Uh, both with great great customer base, uh, Houston, San Antonio, and then we're uh, we're looking to expand into a couple new markets. We'll announce at some point here in the near fu near future. So, what markets? Well, I guess it's, this is uh, the tease here. But yeah. what markets are you looking to prioritize? What are the any new uh, expansion or future growth that you want to talk about, or you can't yet? I feel like you asked me the same question last year. We, uh, <laughs> we we cannot say just yet, but one one will be announced here pretty soon, so it will not be a surprise for much longer. And then the uh, the second market will not be a shock to anybody. So I'll I'll leave it at that. All right, yeah. fair enough, fair enough. Now, one thing that comes to mind again when you hear Stream and your brand, you are known to be customer centric. Um, how has this uh, approach? been applied to your client management, your, your best practices? Sure. Well, we're all, customers are our focus. We're all in this business to serve our customers. And so, um, you know, the customer always matters. I know it's a cliche, but that, that really, that really is uh, the approach we take to business. Um, and so we, we try to instill that at all levels of the organization and make sure everybody's thinking along those lines with everything they do. Yeah. Yeah. And it shows, it, it absolutely shows. Um, so looking forward to 2019, What's, uh, what can we expect from Stream and what, what trends are you seeing that you're, uh, you're looking to leverage? So obviously with the, the Chicago facility being available now, uh, the, the DFW7 facility uh, you know, being uh, completed late summer, uh, major focus in, in, in filling those facilities and, and, and uh, you know, taking the next step there. And then obviously as we announce these new markets, getting underway with construction is going to be a big deal. So that, that'll be a huge focus for us. In addition, and I, I think we talked about this last year, we have a whole operational uh, facilities management arm where we will operate other people's data centers. So that's, that's really gaining momentum. Um, it kind of picked up in late 18 and, and uh, we hope to, to have a lot of success with that in 19. And yeah. again, it speaks to that client-centric model. So wonderful news. Expansion is definitely uh, in the thoughts and minds of not only Stream, but its clients who are benefiting from that. Um, so if you want to know more information about Stream, where can they go? Uh, feel free to reach out to me. My information is on the website. You can always you can always call me. Uh, but the website in general will tell you a lot of information uh, about us. You can always call Jamie too. Uh, but no, we're, we have a ton of information online, um, not only about us, but just about our thoughts on energy spend, on development, best practices. So there's more on our website than than just uh, property information. There's a lot of a lot of good uh, rich content. Yeah, great education that you put out for our industry as well. So streamdatacenter.com. Yep. And again, Michael, thank you so much for joining us. And thank you viewers for tuning in to JSA TV. Happy networking.